yo boys what is going on this is something it's been it's been a while since i played this uh we're back on the good old school reliable uh slrr injected by vlad that's why that's right we because we're going to be time attacking and we don't want no shady drift physics you know we want that we want that legit physics so last episode it seems it appears i needed to uh, uh, skim through my uh my old video since i have a not made uh, one of these and since let me just check since let me just check october 3rd right now it's october 21st uh and it seems that last episode i, j I just made the engine faster i just upgraded the engine 246 horsey boys man uh it seems that i have not I have not fucked about with uh, anything else. I don't think I've set any laps and shit like that. So uh, that is that is good. Uh, but yeah, let's. I'm gonna throw a shout out to um, Victor Volkov. Thanks for commenting. Uh, thanks for you know losing power just means you pass peak power. Yeah, you know that's all Gucci gang shit. But today we will be doing some uh, camshaft tuning before I get right into it. So I'm gonna do that off camera. All right. It seems that the car uh, was well tuned. Um, so we didn't really need to do any more tuning, but uh, I'm debating. Yeah, I'm gonna change the tires. I want to buy some newer uh, tires. Not that those are well worn or something, but we need something a bit more. I I'm going for a best time. So last time, the last time I did a good time was when I changed the wheels and the suspension and then the tires, and that got me a 1.07. That's, that's pretty good. That's a pretty good time, if you ask me. So. Let's get some of those uh, racing tires, uh, advance. Yeah, let's buy let's buy four advance. That seems like a good a good choice, a good thing to get. And um, we've got the SL Potenzas, uh, but we're going to throw, throw some advance on and see how they do. Let's see how they do. Okay, uh, let's go on the track and uh, hope for the best. Let me just actually click fix it on ev on everything. And uh, let's go and try Tsukuba Circuit. Alright, so remember the last best time I uh, achieved was 1 minute, 0, 0 0.7 seconds, 0.868. So that's a good time. And let's see what we can achieve now with a better engine, I think. In theory, I, sh I don't know if I dr I've driven this engine though, you know. I, d I don't re remember anything. <laughs> it's been so long since... It, it yeah, 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 that 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 was the thing. I, I forgot about that. I forgot that that was a possibility. <laughs> that's not that's not a nice possibility. But I need to be very careful with my uh, turning and whatnot. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Maybe yeah. I'll definitely up the red line on this car. Definitely needs a higher red line. But it's gripping very nicely. It's, it's going very, very swell. Now, obviously, oh man, I forgot that I can't take this corner for shit. Now, obviously, I haven't driven in. <laughs> like I said, I haven't played this in a, in how more than half of a month, uh, and so I'm a bit rusty. I'm a bit rusty. I don't know, dude. The last episode, I just did engine shit. So in theory, this this car should be faster than it was before. Alright, now this is the real lap, or hopefully I won't spin out and uh, not even spin out, flip over. Oh, way too deep. I'm trying not to lock up the wheels. That's my goal. And I kind of fucked it there. Okay, okay, that was not too bad. Oh man, you know, this car needs a turbo. <laughs> This car definitely needs a turbo, you know, it will help with with the struggle. You know, I don't want, I don't need too much power though, you know, because it, uh, then, then it will become uh, uncontrollable. What we need is a turbo. Yeah, definitely need a higher t uh, red line too. Definitely need a higher red line too. Okay, oh. Gucci, Gucci, Gucci. Come on, 3-4. Was that a bit too early? I think that was a bit too early to go into fifth. We've got no sound. That's good. Yeah, 1.04, dude. My last best was a 1.7. 
Yo, that was... I shattered the record, dude. I shattered it by a lot. Like, the car is apparently much... I think it, it, it did gain, like, 100 or, or so. 100 odd horsepower over uh, over the ra last record. So, you know, that's pretty good. The, ca the car has definitely got, got, some, uh, got some power on it. Uh... You know, a few more tweaks, and we can definitely be legit, legit on this uh, on this track. The suspension seems to be very well set up. It's not, it's not, you know, it's not. Uh, it doesn't have body roll. I don't know, man. I think I think we've got ourselves a good car, and it's just lacking on power. I mean, honest, honestly, if I throw it to a higher red line, I think we'll j we'll have a bit more. Uh, a bit more of a of luck there. Ah, that was not better. That was not better. Not good. Well, that's a lot of spinning. Yeah, it's it's seven thousand RPM. Just does not seem to be the right position for this engine. Just does not seem to be the. Because you know you need to, because the 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 dip between between second and third gear is just way too massive it cannot it cannot d pull there so we're losing off a lot of speed we just cannot because we cannot get up to speed oh that was not good that was not clean at all that was so dirty and not even in a good way okay this will be the last lap I'm, I'm going to go and fix the car especially because since since I, well, I went <laughs> since I flipped it and um I'm going to get the the rev at least to 8k or something. Oh, that's way too wide. Yep. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Uh, let's go and do that. All right. So I got. So the car revs to 8333 now, which I think will help. Like, we definitely passed the pa the peak power there, like quite a by quite a lot, but. Yeah, you see, second gear is now serviceable. Second gear is now serviceable, and I think that will that will damage the engine. The engine will fall apart easier. Since this is now a high revving RB. But the, the dip that was second and third is now much smaller. As you can see, like, in third gear is definitely struggling to uh, sh to get up there. But that doesn't matter. We just need it. We need we need that high red line for second gear. I can avoid using it in, in the other gears. It's just you know we're playing e economics. Like 7.5 is a very good place to shift. But like right now we don't need to go into fifth gear where it's not efficient. You see, you know that was that was good. I over oh that was a big over ref there, and I overshot the corner. There's no ABS, you know. So um, oh, a bit too much braking there, and not a good line, not a good line. We still dipped third gear, but the uh, the dip in third gear is not as large it is, as it once was. A bit of the track. You gotta lock it. I had to lock it there. I did not have to lock it, obviously. The engine, is, the car is chugging along. The engine seems to be definitely, definitely takes a bit, a bit of a bigger hit. You gotta be careful. Rear end. We don't want the rear end to go out too much. 10.5 hmm okay it's too late to downshift um, can the, can the engine I think that was just a bad lap I don't think oh man this engine is getting pushed real hard right now Maybe the red line uh, where it is right now is is a bit harder for the car to 
Uh, but I, I definitely think we're I'm going faster on the straight since I need to be breaking a bit more. And I think that's really fucking with me. Also, you can see the left tire is definitely starting to take damage, as is the engine, too. Um, they're definitely taking some, uh, some wear and tear. Oh, rear end. Likes to go out the rear end, doesn't it? Ooh, that was, I, th I don't know if that was better than the last one. No, I, I definitely think the engine, uh, the, the, the high red line definitely helps. Uh, oh, oversteer. Not good. Not good, not good at all. Oh man, I'm throwing fucking mad laps on this. I think this is how oh, this is. Okay, not the best. Not the best, but not the worst either. Okay, 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 okay. Yo, 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 yo. Oh, shit. Yo, fuck, dude. A temp a 1.03, dude. Holy shit. Holy shit. There's much room for improvement. Like a cleaner line, less, less, uh, less sliding of the rear end. But the engine and the front tires are definitely taking a beating currently. Look at the engine in the, in the front, especially the front left tire is way down on, on durability. Oh, oh, 103, dude, that's so good. That is so good. Not the best entry there. Oh no, this could have been this could have been a very good lap. Alright, I'm throwing one last lap, dude. I'm throwing one last lap. Because the engine is already No Ah. Oh. Ooh. Oh guys, that that was good. A 103? Oh that's so good. That's We went from a 107 to a 103 without any turbos or anything, dude. Holy I think I can get this car no problem under under uh yeah, 66%. The engine is fucked too. We might need to... Oh, so this is this is still... I might go for a full uh, stage 4 NA build. And then maybe turbo it. Or maybe turbo this. I don't know, dude, guys. I don't know, guys. But... Ooh, that was, that was good. That was definitely good. Oh, yeah. This car is... I love this car. Um, yeah, so... Thank you for watching, and next time, I don't know, what do you guys think should I should be doing? Should I do some weight reduction and, you know, making it a bit more aerodynamic and shit like that? Or uh, should I be doing more engine stuff? I don't know, what do you guys think? But yeah, thank you for watching. I also very like the Advance, again, to continue using them. But yeah, thank you for watching, and I'm going to see you in the next one.